Hey, good day guys, this is your boy Chibuza Agwa and you're welcome to Blogging for the channel. Um, just like the title of this video said, I will be showing you how to make $100 from your blog without having display ads running on it. Yes, um, actually it's $100 as a benchmark, but you could be making something between $70 to above $100 or whatsoever amount you can take up because that's the method I've been using and most bloggers out there have been using it. You know, um, before anybody kickstarts um, his or her blog, uh, most people believe that the best way is actually the best way and uh, no doubt about that but most people believe that the only way they can make money from their blog is having display ads running on it so that they can earn um, revenues um we all know that we have various um, ad networks out there we have google adsense we have mediavine we have medianet we have tabula and um, the likes and you will agree with me that there are certain criteria your blog needs to meet before they will actually approve your blog or your site for it to start displaying their ads and for it to start making money. But it doesn't mean that you should start waiting till your blog or your site um, attains that height or criteria before you start making money. If, if you want to do that, you just started your blog and maybe you've been receiving a series of dis um, disapproval emails from these various ad networks out there, that doesn't mean you, should, you shouldn't start making money from your blog. So that's what I'll be teaching you right here in this video. It's actually a method that I've been using or most people have been using just like myself so i'm giving you a testimony from my own parts i have made lots of money there's a particular side of mine um I, 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 which i talked about also in this video i made a whole lot of money and that's what i'll be showing what you do exactly what i did in this video so um if you're one of those that have been facing disapproval from this video side network I would encourage you to smash the like button of this video and also go to the comment section and tell us the problem you've been facing and we'll see what we'll talk about that. But in this video, you can start making money from your blog from now on. I'll be show actually showing you um, two, um, two ways or two methods, yes, and that's the reason why I encourage you to stick to this video to the end. And you can actually hit the subscribe button, there's a red button below this video that you're watching so that you be part of this family, part of this channel, and you get notified whenever I release similar videos just like this. So having done that, uh, we shall be moving to my um, laptop screen because that's where I'll be showing you physical um, step-by-step method, what you will do, um, exactly what I've done in achieving this height. Yes, you can start making that money from today if you've not yet been approved by Google AdSense, MediaNet, or whatsoever, and be exoic or whatsoever. So that's what I'll be showing you in this video. So that's like I said, hit the smash the like button so that to encourage um, YouTube to push this video so people like you who needs this information naturally see it and also subscribe and turn on the bell notification. So having done that now, let's move to my laptop screen. Just like I told you, stick to this video to the end because you'll be seeing lots of secrets which nobody else will tell you. So let's move. You are welcome to Blog Info Tech YouTube channel. So welcome back guys. And now as you can see, we are now on my laptop screen. And that's where I will show you what I talked about. Yes, how to make $100 daily on your blog without display ads or without being approved by any display ad network. Um, actually, um, my Windows is up, um, updating at the background. So I want to make this video as fast as possible and in case maybe um i missed any segment and if there's any question we like to ask i would like you to also make your notes and go to the comment section and drop your question and i will attend to them accordingly yes speedily immediately i read them i'll try as much as possible to respond to your queries so having that in mind now let us move down to business just like i said i'll be showing how to make one thousand dollars daily on your blog without display ads and like I said, um, during the intro, you can make more than $100. Um, you can make um, less than $100, but know that you will be receiving passive income without doing nothing on your blog, even though you don't have display ads approved on it. So what are the means? So by what means are you going to make this money from your blog? What are the things you should do? And basically, the thing is what? What means can you make this money? It's just simply by accepting sponsored posts. Um, I believe you might have heard this word before, but you're quite confused. Maybe you've not received any sponsored posts. It's actually paid posts. So, um, like I was saying, I'll break it down. So, what are sponsored posts? Um, before we move ahead, we shall be. Um, I divided this um, this videos in the head into 
four subtopics which I'll be looking at so that at least I'll be moving um, covering what I should be talking about in this video um, accordingly so the first um, topic we shall be looking at is what are sponsored posts they're the best niches for sponsored posts then how to get sponsored post offers um, um, I'll be talking about two simple ways and finally we shall be looking at how to retrieve your payments after securing a sponsored post deal so having note that now let us move to the first subtopic which is what what are sponsored posts so I gave my own definition I said sponsored posts are basically posts that are published on the site the site of a publisher just like you on a site or a blog by advertisers or business owners with the intent of creating awareness of their products or services and a specified fee is being paid to the publisher or owner of the blog and um, what this simply means is that advertisers they do outreaches they conduct outreaches via SEOs or they can even um, email you by themselves what they intend what they have in mind is to either make um, advertise your products their services or make their blog known so that people can easily patronize them with business that is the major intent of sponsored posts also another intent people um, have in mind while um, conducting outreaches to various publishers in order to sponsor articles on their blog is to is for backlinking is another process of link building yes um, a publisher normally offer them do follow backlink and what you should notice that sponsor posts comes in the form of press releases product review and informational articles so practically let us now move just like i said i'm updating my site so i will be having a little bit of slow internet so this is my email um one of my emails actually if you should go into this you see that for example let me open this first one i do receive tons of sponsored plus request on a daily this is an actual um, actually delivered yes actually delivered the sponsor post and i dropped the link to the blog so these are example of sponsored posts i received tons of them on a daily basis so i normally once i finish dealing with you i normally move it to trash so let me go to my trash um um folder for you to see what i'm talking about like i said i'm updating my windows at the background so my internet will be a little bit slow so now let's go to my trash folder you see lots and lots and tons of them for example this is a sponsored post this is a sponsored post this is a sponsored post these are sponsored post um, requests that comes in daily and I attend to them and I get as in they pay me in dollars, yes, a minimum of $50 from the range of $50 to $150. It depends on what the person is trying to publish and the aim of the sponsored post. As you can see, if I should scroll down, you see tons of them. Once I publish an article and you pay me, I normally delete your email. So it moves to my trash so these are what i'm talking about is a specific proof that yes i am doing this naturally i just got the system i just got this laptop so i can't really log into my paypal account with this laptop at the moment so if not i would have showed you various payments i've received from various advertisers or seus that conducts outreaches for me to publish their posts on my blog and they pay me in dollars so that is what you should be doing from today. You can be earning in dollars. But that doesn't mean um, I have lots of blog like you already know or some of you might already know. And um, I actually have display ads on some of my blogs or most of my blogs. So that doesn't mean I don't accept sponsored posts on that blogs even at this moment. So what I'm just trying to do, if you've not yet been approved yes, by any ad network, especially from Google AdSense, you can actually start making money by doing what I'm about to show to you on this video. So you have you have an idea of what um, sponsored put is all about. So now let us move to the next um, stop topic, which is a, which is the best niches for sponsored posts. Um, from my years of um, blogging, yes, I actually started blogging a long time ago, and um, actually I've actually been in the business of um, publishing sponsored posts or paid posts on my blog for some time. And these are the niches that I believe or practically I've seen that most people that normally attract um, sponsored post buyers. The first um, niche is a health niche. Yes, I've ha I have a health blog that I made 
tremendous um, amount of money. I could remember my first uh, blog, is actually a health blog, which I started far back 2004. And by then, um, um, you know, we're in Nigeria and there's a kind of difficulty for you to um, receive and um, to get approved um, by Google Ads. And so I, I, I waited for a while. During, my, during the period of which I actually delved into what sponsored posts and that help blog actually generated me a lot of money. Yes, if you should start a help blog today, I am promising you that yes, it's just an assurance. And if the blog is well established, have the right content, um, has the right metrics that people are looking for, I'm assuring you that you start receiving tons of emails requesting to publish a sponsored post on your blog and you get paid accordingly. And the next niche um, I shall be um, that I categorize as one of the best niches for sponsored posts is what technology niche. I have a, actually have a technology blog that I am running till date and I'm still receiving sponsored post requests. Actually, the email that I showed you earlier, um, yes, this email is actually the email of my technology blog and you can see the amount of sponsored posts or emails that I've been receiving on a daily basis and, and I actually published a post and I've been paid. Yes, and I do receive money as I am aside um, display ads money or affiliate marketing that I also make money from from my various blogs. So the next niche or the third niche on my list is what travel niche. Um, I'm practically going to give you an example of a story. There's a travel um, blog that I have. I actually saw the blog either two years back. Yes, I saw the blog and the contents in it, the domain and whatsoever. I, I, I when I set up this blog, um. Within a short period of time, I discovered that people started sending me emails requesting to publish a sponsored post on my travel blog. I will tell you the reason why once we move ahead. So, um, and each um, each blog post or each sponsored post I publish on this very travel blog, I earn nothing less than $100. Yes, $100 on this travel blog. But in my technology blog and my health blog, I'm receiving a range of $70 per sponsored post. And you could imagine if you should um, receive an email requesting for them to publish, let's say, three sponsored posts on your blog. So if you should times, let me say, minimum of $50 times three, times three on a daily basis, you see that you're making um, $150 on a sponsored post. And that is without you doing anything. You have to supply the post for you. Some even went as far as providing um, the image that you use in the post. All you have to do is to log into your blog and publish the article and you get paid. You can see that is another um, passive income means without you doing anything. But all you have to do is have an established blog. So the next um, niche that I see from my um, years of experience is business and finance niche. Yes, once you are into this niche, you see that you start receiving sponsored posts from various um financial institutions, the financial sites or site that deals with finance or you can also um, sometimes receive them sponsored posts from forex trading sites once you're operating on this niche. Also in technology you also receive sponsored posts from that. And one good thing about the technology niche that I skipped, for example, um, um, products, owners of products, okay there's a particular email that I got, let me go to the email, is actually an invite this is actually an invite, not sponsored, but as in this case, an invite for me to become an affiliate of a particular video software. Now, let me go back to what I'm talking about. If you're running a technology need, technology need is quite vast. You, uh, there's a particular time I, I published a sponsored post for ExpressVPN. I guess most of you must know the VPN service. And what they do in essence is that they give me a one-year um, one year uh, premium package which I can use on my laptop, on my mobile devices for free. All I have to do is to publish a sponsored post and give them a mention in that post. They actually provided the article and I did nothing. And they gave me one year free premium services that I used. And that is one of the advantage of technology. And also, um, there is a particular, um, most of you must have heard about in video. Yes, in video is actually a, a that's how you can make videos. You can turn and um, text to videos, and you can do so many things. If you know InVideo. Um, yes, I you can actually go to the site and see what I'm talking about. So I'm actually running a promotion for them at the moment in the sense that I published an article on my blog and they gave me one year 
free oh, it's actually a lifetime premium but i don't really know but it's either a one-year premium or a lifetime premium license so this is one of the adva advantages we are running in technology um blog technology League. so there are vast opportunities you receive sponsored posts by which you pay um physical cash they will transfer it to your either your paypal accounts or your pioneer accounts or they can give you the product to review and they will give you a premium plan so these are the advantages so the last niche i shall be talking about which i see is the best niche for sponsored post offers is what casino was actually you should know that once you're running um, a casino blog or a ca you're running the casino niche you should know that you can never get approval from google adsense yes, because this niche as a whole or articles that are related to gambling is actually a turn down you won't get a, um, approval it's actually against them um, the google um webmaster rule or google adsense policy so once you're running this niche you should know that you bear it in mind that yes you're not looking for google adsense approval but you shall be focusing on sponsored posts and i i'm sure you that yes you make a lot of money so these are the top um five niches that i believe that once you go into them or once you set a blog that is um um ties to this niche teams to this niche you start making money from sponsored articles so you can shut them down um there are so many other niches if you have any other ones that you have in mind you can still go to the comment section and lay your comment that yes you are operating on this niche and you've been receiving tons and tons of sponsored posts and hey before we proceed just like i said from the start if you like this video thus far you can smash the like button yes it actually um gives the youtube algorithm um, a signal to actually push this video forward for people like you that wants to benefit from this information to actually come across the video so now let us move to the next sub topic having gone through this you've treated the best niches now the next one is one now how to get sponsored post offers like i said or i've been saying why i was explaining this. So first thing you have to do is what have an established blog on the niches i explained earlier and they said an established blog in the sense that yes you have a blog which you are writing to your new articles and you add or you have your, your articles actually come um, attracting tons of traffic from search engine yes that's one of the major criteria because how they actually um how this um people that conduct sponsored post outreaches how they actually come across the blog is that for example they key in some certain words and see how or the major blogs that are ranking on that specific keywords and if your blog is false among the least, let me say the top five, please, you see that you start receiving tons and tons of sponsored posts, be it in any niche. So you should have an established blog based on the niche that I explained earlier, either be it health, technology, um, casino, um, travel, um, business and finance, forex or whatsoever, but let it be established. You should have unique articles on your blog. Yes, you should desist from um, copying posts or images and place them on your blog let it be unique let it be established now <clears throat> then <clears throat> another means of yes is to start a new blog by buying domains with high da if you know that yes um, achieving this first point is quite difficult you can actually skip that and all you have to do is to start a new blog by buying domains with high da you know i talked about my travel blog where i receive sponsors on the daily basis whereby the minimum amount they do pay is hundred dollars so what you actually do is this method actually start a new blog by buying and domains with idea you know i said if you skip back if you go back to my subtopics let's see i talked about how to get sponsored posts using two simple ways so the first way is the one i've talked about is what's having established blog on the niche i explained earlier it's quite simple but a little bit task here i have so many established blogs but i have to do a practical by buying um starting a new blog by buying domains with high da that is expired domains so i was talking about my travel blog so what i did with my travel blog then um i actually went to most of you must have heard about expired domains that expired domains actually the website is expired domains.net yes this is the website so what this website do offers is um 
you can see various domains. These are the avail uh, availability and this green sign. You can see most of these domains are available for purchase. So these are actually domains that people use and maybe because of one reason or the other, they fail to renew the domain best known to them actually. So you can actually come to expireddomains.net and conduct research and you actually see um, domains you can buy. So what I did actually, or what I intended for you to do, for example, if you want to follow this um, second method instead of um, trying to or spend either, let me say, time, months, to have an established domain whereby you conduct link building and the rest. In having an expired domain, there are so many links that are pointing to the domain, so it has a little bit of authority. Domain authority, that has the meaning of DA. It has a little bit of domain authority based on Moore's ranking. So now let us go back to the website. So for example, you can just um, type in on your keyboard expired domains.net. Domains in the sense that it has an S, not domain expireddomains.net so now once you're on the expired domain i actually um i would have logged in but i don't want to experience any screen time but so if you get to expired domain you now click on deleted domains deleted domains this is it you click on it and it will display this this is not how actually the home page um displays okay the talent it slows faster so now once you're here for example if you want to um establish or start a new domain on the health niche what you have to do for example if you should scroll at the top you see um where it says shows filter these are all domains but you are looking for a particular um the criteria you want to search for before you buy a domain so now you now click on show filter so I'm actually want to actually want to um, create a filter. Oh, it demands that I should log in, and it's actually logging me out. So actually, let me see. I don't know the reason why. I've tried several to log in, but let me see if it will go. This is a new system. I've not logged in on my domain. My password wasn't saved in this. So let's leave that for now. So what you do, you go to deleted domains, just like I said. So once you, you filter, so the two major criteria you should be looking at, you should type in um, keywords. For example, you say the domain that contains the world health. Once you like um, purchase an expired domain related to health. So once you key in your criteria, the domain that contains the world health, and let me see you now um let me see if the filter won't work without me logging and i won i forgot my passwords are saved on my distance so i can really log in at the moment so you just key in a specific um keywords that you're looking for example you type in the, the domain should contain the word health and it should have backlinks not less than 1000 and once you've placed in that filter you're saving your filter and you see that the domains that have that criteria that you've keyed in appear here and you actually now conduct various researches now the next thing you do after let's say the domains appear and you want to choose a particular domain you want to buy so the you can just um key in the da checker that's domain authority checker and you always arrive at some um, website seo checker so you click on website seo checker to actually check the domain the, the da of the domain that you want to purchase. Let's see, just like I said, my um, my window is actually updating from the background. So now, let's see, for example, there's a particular um, domain. Let's use this um, that you now check. I actually want to check the domain and the, the, the domain authority. Like I said, DA checker, domain authority checker. I want to check the domain authority of this very domain. You now key in the domain, the full URL of the domain. So you now check. <clears throat> I want to check the DA of this domain and see if it is worth buying. So as you can see, it's now displayed the results. So the DA of this domain is 21 as, and I believe it's on the high side. Any domain above 20 is okay. The travel block that I used then, the domain authority was about 39. So you can see that's the more reason why it pushes sponsored post offer. You know, remember we're talking about how to get 
sponsored post offer. So the, the, the people that conduct outreach or are actually looking for blog whereby they'll post their um their their article or their press releases or their product reviews and what they're looking for is actually blogs with high domains. If it's not established ranking properly on Google, then they should have high DA. Domain authority is just um, actually a metric um, by most. So this is a two way. So if you can't um, or if you have an established blog already, and hey, before I proceed, let me like give a proper information. Niches that falls on entertainment are quite difficult to have sponsored post offer. So if you already have a blog and it's an entertainment blog, I am sorry to tell you that you have little or no emails or requests or offers coming from sponsored posts, which means you actually make no money. Remember the best niches I told you about, let your niche fall within this category and you are good to go. If you have a blog already and you can easily open a new blog and let it be cited within those niches. So if you want to open a new blog or maybe you've searched or inspired domain and you want to go ahead and buy the domain, and you can, in the description of this video, I actually um, I'll place links whereby you can purchase cheap domain at a, discounted, at a discounted price and also hosting at a discounted price. You can go to the description on this video. I'll place two links, one for domain purchase and one for hosting purchase. There are actually affiliate links I'll open about that. There's actually affiliate links, which means that once you um, purchase, uh, make a purchase via the link, I'll be receiving certain percentage of commission. So having done that, so if you already have an established blog within those niches that I talked about, I believe you should be receiving offers by now. But if you don't have it, you can start a new blog today. And if you don't want to start a new blog, you can actually use the process I talked about by going to expireddomains.net and buy domains that people actually abandon without renewing them so there are two options and i believe the two ways are still simple so you can follow them and you can start receiving sponsored post offers from today so now the next topic we shall be looking at i uh, believe is almost it. so now how to receive your payments once you have an established blog you've received um, emails um, indicating that they want to publish a um, sponsored post on the blog so now how do you receive the payments I already gave you a tidbit, so I talked about it from the beginning. And the first one is about having a PayPal account. Yes, you need to have a PayPal account because most um, people that conduct outreach is most SEOs actually pay via PayPal. Um, yes, you have to open a PayPal account. But if you're in Nigeria, uh, you know we all are facing restrictions about PayPal, how to receive payment from PayPal. So, but many people have done videos, many people have written articles on how you can create a PayPal account even in Nigeria. And you start receiving money in your people account. So if you've not come across such articles, you can go to Google from now and key in how to have um, a people account in Nigeria and receive money. You see various um, results. You can go through them. But if you don't want to go through um, Google, you can actually search for it right here in YouTube. You see various videos that talked about how to create a PayPal account in Nigeria and how you can start receiving money. And the next um, PayPal is the major options that most people prefer most of the people that are conducting outreaches on sponsored posts so i will advise you to actually have a paper like that if you're still in nigeria and um, you see that i've dropped lots of videos and how you can withdraw your money from paypal to your nigerian bank account you can do it yourself without um saving yourself the stress of maybe all these paypal merchants paypal vendors or people that buy paypal funds you can actually withdraw your PayPal account. You can, okay, in the description of this same video, I will be dropping links to how I explain that. That is for my Nigerian viewers. Yes, I showed you how you can withdraw your money from your PayPal to your Payoneer and from your Payoneer, which down to your Nigerian bank account. So the next option that most um, SEOs or people that conduct link outreaches uses to pay um, publishers is actually through Payoneer. So I advise you if you're in Nigeria, you can open a paypal and a pioneer account yes if you are, are into digital marketing in nigeria now yet to have a paypal or a pioneer account i will tell you that you've not started yet because these are the major um gateways by which most people that are into digital marketing actually receive their payments um from abroad from international countries down to nigeria so i'll advise you to open a pioneer account and start receiving your funds yes from now on so now the third um the third 
the third uh, methods by which you can receive your payment is through cryptocurrency but this is very rare they are very rare as in they are very and few um, sponsored post seekers that will actually prefer to pay through cryptocurrency but I and most of my colleagues actually say that they receive payments via cryptocurrency which simply means that you have to have a cryptocurrency wallet from any exchanges of your choice so you have to open um if you already have you can just give them a link they will if they prefer paying to bitcoin ethereum maybe xrp dodge or whatsoever whatsoever cryptocurrency they, they prefer to pay you which you can just litecoin you can just give them your wallet address and they will transfer the amount of money let's say for example don't to pay hundred dollars they will transfer you hundred dollars worth of bitcoin down to your wallet so that's at the three major means which you can receive your payment but the the, the top of them all is paper you need to have a paper account if you're not having a paper account though you're in nigeria there you'll be experiencing lots of limitations in the digital marketing world so just create a paper account then you are good to go so now with that i believe we've come to the end of um, this video so like i said if i skipped um, any important notes or maybe you want to ask a question you confuse it in any angle you can go to the comment section drop your question and i will attend to it as fast as possible so like i said drop your comments drop your questions in the comment section or if you have words of encouragement also go to the comment section and tell us what to do and also before you leave don't forget to um, like this video just like i said smash the like button like i always say because it gives the youtube algorithm signal to push this video for people to see you can also share this video to your colleagues or friends or whatsoever if you find it informative enough and also before you leave in case you've not hit the subscribe button just hit the subscribe button that red button below this video you're watching and also turn on the bell notification so that you get notified whenever i release um similar important videos just like this so having that in mind i believe um we have come to this end of this video so what you should do after you've subscribed is to just sit back with us and anticipate for my next video so we come to the end. Chibuza Agua remains my name. I'm blogging for Tech as a channel. So we shall see in my next video. But hey, drop your comments and I will attend to them. So bye bye for now.